taking the duck face in photos. It's not always a good look, but it's certainly not going to compromise your security. I'm more of a blue steel guy. Are you? Oh, yeah, no. I like it. <laughs> there is another pose, though, that might. Meredith Sensula is here with how good-natured fun could lead to getting ripped off in an eight-on-your-side alert. What is all this about, Mayor? All right, so anytime you flash a peace sign, V for victory, or if I have a habit of doing uh, jazz hands, I don't know what that's all about. Well, we do have a warning for you because if your fingertips are in focus and if there's strong lighting, people could actually copy your fingertips and use them to steal your identity. How do they do that? Well, they make fake fingers. Yeah, that's right. Then they use those replicated fingertips to gain access to anything that uses a fingerprint identification, like signing into your phone. You can access your banking apps that way. And if you think that can't happen, well, it actually has. Japanese researchers tried it. They used a 20 megapixel camera, and they found that up to nearly 10 feet away, the fingerprints were defined enough to recreate them. Now, that same research institute, well, they are using that technology to develop a special film that can be applied to your fingertips to protect them. But that technology won't be available for about two years or so. And do you really want to wear that? No, I know I don't. So for now, maybe just don't flash the peace sign or think twice about doing it anyway. Guys, <laughs> back to you. I would say peace out, but uh, no, now we can't. I can't, can't peace out now. <laughs> Thanks, Mayor. <laughs>